my sweet awesome Taurus people I missed you guys Taurus I hope you're doing wonderful wherever you are Taurus you want to check up on the latest energies between you and your soulmates so that's what we're gonna do first part of the video we're gonna ask what's coming towards you what you'll be dealing with facing and how you're currently doing on your soulmate journey second part of this video we're gonna ask about your soulmate whoever it is you're thinking of while watching this video whether you're currently in contact with them or not we're gonna ask what's going on with your soulmate at this time how they are currently relating to you emotionally and what's on their mind what they thinking feeling especially in relation to you universe please step in show very clear and important messages for the sign of taurus for taurus highest good please Universe, what's coming towards Taurus? What will Taurus be dealing with facing? And how is Taurus currently doing on this soulmate journey they on? This one wants to come out very strongly as extra message. <clears throat> oh, wow, look at this. Knight of Wands reversed. Wow, <laughs> Taurus. Taurus, you are the Empress energy, whether you're male or female. This is you dealing with somebody from your past or recent past. This is your soulmate. Your soulmate has been in and out of your life, in and out, in and out of your life, not consistent. But look at this. This is you looking at them and they upside down. I am very curious to see what will clarify their energy. You are showing up as having very high standards. Yeah. And they've been inconsistent in your life. They haven't been reciprocal. They haven't reciprocated. Wow, look at this. Somebody's coming in with the opposite energy. Coming in with reciprocity. Offer. So this person. Yeah, this person wants to re-enter your life. Hmm. Look at this, you are fabulous. Whether you're male or female, you're showing up here as very grounded, consistent, reliable, taking care of yourself, not needing anyone to support you emotionally or financially. This is you taking care of yourself. Let me see what's going on here. Universe, please show us what's coming towards Taurus. What will Taurus be dealing with facing and how is Taurus currently doing on this soulmate journey they own. <clears throat> wow. So this person is going through major changes to meet you halfway to be reciprocal. Somehow they are aware that they can come in, they cannot come in with the same energy from the past where they were wishy-washy in and out of your life <coughs> and not consistent. Wow. This is you. You've been through a lot of stress because of this connection being wishy-washy. This is you ending this relationship. You ended this relationship. You let them go. You release them. But yet, you're looking right at them right now. This is you facing them. Uh, this person caused you a lot of heartbreak. Uh, yeah, and I'm sure they're aware of it. I am positive they're aware of it. They've caused you a lot of heartbreak, pain. Yeah. Wow. This person misses you. Uh, so they know, yeah, they're very much aware how they acted and what they need to be like to be uh, considered for another chance. This is them missing you. Yeah. See, they want to offer you something. Uh, that's very different from the past. But whether you accept it or not will be up to you, Taurus. You are the Empress energy. You cannot be with a person who has low vibration energy, who is not reciprocal, because you're going to be drained. Yeah, so Empress deserves high vibration person who is reciprocal, who communicates, who is grounded, reliable. You cannot be dealing with this player energy from the past. Yeah, you see? They've been in and out of your life, checking up on you, spying on you through videos like this, social media. They're spying on you. <sighs> Look at this. You know you deserve happiness, joy, fulfillment. You don't deserve drama. You know that. 
You are an empress energy. Empress doesn't chase anybody. Everybody chases the empress. And what does the empress do? Empress picks and chooses. Yeah, you see this person is missing you a lot. They're going through major changes in their life. It's like they're being reborn. They needed to lose you to appreciate your value, your worth as a person. They didn't appreciate you when they had you. Unfortunately, they had to lose you to see how valuable you were in their life. Yeah. You see, they want you. This person wants you in their life and they're willing to put work into this. But whether you accept them or not, Taurus will be up to you. It's not going to be up to them, really. It's going to be up to you. Let's see what's going on here. This is you. Beautiful energy to describe you, Taurus. This is you taking care of you. Yeah, grounded, reliable, resourceful, intelligent, giving, nurturing, loving, marriage material. This is beautiful to describe you. Universe, please show us. What's coming towards Taurus? What will Taurus be dealing with facing? And how is Taurus currently doing on this soulmate journey? Look at this. This is you healing from heartbreak. So this person caused you a lot of heartbreak. They did. I'm sure they are aware of it. Yeah. They caused you a lot of heartbreak. You see, this is you healing from this heartbreak. Uh, yeah, this is healing energy, earth energy, grounded energy. This is you healing from this, retreating in solitude so you can heal, move on. Yeah, you see, beautiful. Some kind of new opportunities coming to you. Here's the Ace of Pentacles. Yeah, rebirth, regeneration, beautiful, major changes in your life for the better. This is you releasing the pain, the toxicity. The heartbreak, healing from the heartbreak. Yeah, you see, you've been through a lot. You are extremely guarded emotionally. I'm sure for good reasons. This is you very guarded emotionally. Yeah, you've been deeply hurt. You see, look at this three of swords and nine of swords. This is you not trusting people easily. Yeah, this is you very guarded, careful, cautious, analytical. Wow, let's see what's going on with this person. Let's see. Universe, please show us the soulmate of Taurus. The soulmate of Taurus. How is the soulmate of Taurus currently doing? What's going on with the soulmate of Taurus? And how is the soulmate of Taurus currently feeling towards Taurus? And what's on soulmate's mind? Let's see, Taurus. Oh, this is them. This is them like not trusting their intuition. Reverse hermit. It's like they're not trusting themselves. Yeah, they want to rush in and communicate with you. Hmm, very objectively, like without showing any type of emotions, just very objective communication, but they don't trust their intuition. They don't trust themselves. Yeah, they want to manifest something. A lot of you are dealing with Virgo, Gemini, Aquarius, Libra. Yeah, this is how they view you. They view you as marriage material, as somebody solid, grounded, yeah, of value. Yeah, they don't want to let you go. So this is them trying to prove themselves to you. You guys are very different from each other, but honestly, we learn the most from soulmates that are very different. Uh, you two are represented by sphinxes, but one is golden, one is silver. The way you... Uh, project energy into the world is very different their energy is much heavier uh not consistent yeah they're very somber over here let me see what's going on how is the soulmate of taurus doing what's going on with the soulmate of taurus you see they, they know you are available for relationship you guys are not together you see they they feel you are attractive available yeah uh, independent they are not giving up on you this is them feeling beat up exhausted by life circumstances but they're not giving up on you yeah they want to reach out with some kind of emotional offer yeah unexpected communication showing up here out of nowhere universe how is this soulmate currently feeling towards taurus 
Yeah, you see, they want to come in with solid offer. So they know they have to be reciprocal to offer you relationship. You see, when you add nine of pentacles with ace of pentacles, it becomes ten of pentacles, which means this person wants to offer you a long-term relationship that's solid, not wishy-washy like the past. See, this is them quiet right now. Yeah, quiet, retreating in solitude, trying to gain strength, wisdom. Here they're not trusting themselves because they're showing up reversed. It's like they don't have faith in their in themselves. Yeah, you see, they don't want to fight, argue. They want to speak clearly. This is unexpected communication showing up here. Hmm. Wow, let me see what's going on with this chariot, Taurus. A lot of you are dealing with Cancerian. Also, Aries showed up very strongly. And Gemini, let's see, universe, please show us what's going on with the soulmate of Taurus. And how is the soulmate of Taurus, Taurus, Taurus? Oh, they're so heartbroken over you. Just like you heartbroken, they heartbroken. Look at this. Three of swords. Heartbreak. Yeah, I see. They're not giving up on you, not letting you go. Hoping for some kind of positive stuff to happen. Yeah, you see, they view you as uh, not to get... They're viewing you to as not being together in a relationship. They're so heartbroken. They feel like they lost you. Yeah. They're so heartbroken over you. They feel that they lost you. Yeah, very attracted to you. They view you as very independent, attractive, strong-willed, not needing anybody. This person is heartbroken over you. Well, let's see what they do. Look at this, love. Love, new chapters in love showing up for you. Yeah, so... You will have chances with new uh, soulmate if you choose to have a relationship. You're going to have a decision to make, whether it be with this person or not, or somebody else. Yeah, you see, you're going to be meeting new soulmate lovers that you know from past lifetimes. So you're going to make a decision whether you want to be with this past person or new person or nobody. That's going to be up to you. You have what's called free will. You have the... Uh, right to your free will choices. Yeah, you're still going to have to meet the soulmates because you agreed on a soul level to meet them. But what you do with them will be up to you and your free will choices. Yeah, new beginnings in love. You see, Ace of Cups, lovers and new beginnings in love. Um, soulmates that, both soulmates you know from past lifetimes, ancient Egyptian lifetimes showing up here, ancient lifetimes. Taurus, we're going to go into your extended reading and ask about your soulmates, uh, both of them, their true long-term intentions and plans for you. Uh, then we're going to ask what they're hiding from you at this time, whether purposely or not. Uh, but the universe feels you need to be aware of for your highest good. And of course, at the end, we're going to ask advice for you on how to best handle the summit connection at this time. And anything else you need to know about your life, whether it's your health, finances, business, job opportunities, family matters, friendships, whatever it is you need to know, they'll show it at the end of the reading as well. So, Taurus, click on the extended link below this video in the description box below, and I'll see you there. Love you guys.